Alright, this is number two of our interview. It asks to find the gradient of the curve e to the xy plus the natural log of y squared plus e to the y power equals 1 plus e at the point 0, 1. So we know that we could find the gradient of the curve based on the derivative of the function, right? Okay, so to find the derivative of the function, uh, I do the derivative of, um, let's start out with this portion, okay. So that derivative equals e, the derivative of e to the something is just e to the something, right, times the derivative of xy, which is x and the derivative of y, dy dx, plus derivative of x, which is 1, times y. All right. And then we get the derivative of this portion. So the derivative of the natural log of something is just 1 over that number, right? So now the derivative of y squared equals 2y times dy dx, because we do not know the true derivative of y. Now to this portion, that just equals, oh, whoops, e to the y power, right, and the derivative of y, which is dy dx, and then that equals the derivative of 1 plus e, which is, the derivative of 1 is 0, the derivative of e is, well, the, um, because there's no, like, any, ver it's not to any variables, so, and e is a constant, so the derivative of that, which is 0 plus 0, 0. Okay. Now, let's sim simplify this. We want to try to find dy dx, right? I'm going to put that all in one. Okay, so let's do that. That's e x y times x dy dx plus e x y times y plus 2y over y squared dy dx plus e to the y dy d. Oops dx, that equals 0. Now we're going to move everything without dy dx to this side. That's we have e x y x dy dx, that's over to the side, plus 2y over y squared, which is just 2 over y, dy dx, plus e to the y, dy dx equals this portion, negative e x, y, y. And now we take out dy dx, we factor it out, dy dx times e x, y, x plus 2 over y plus e to the y power equals negative e x, y, y. So our derivative is actually dy, so our derivative equals negative e to the x y power times y that was ugly times y over this portion e to the x y power times x plus 2 over y plus e to the y power this gives us the gradient of our curve we want to find the gradient of our curve when x equals 0 and y equals 1 so we have negative e times 0 times 1 to the power, and then times 1 over e to the 0 times 1 power times 0 plus 2 over 1 plus e to the 1 power. So e to the 0 times 1 equals 0, so e to the 0 power equals 1. So that equals negative 1 times 1 over 0 times 1 is 0 again, e to the 0 power is 1, but 1 times 0 equals 0, plus 2 over 1 equals 2, and e, over e to the 1 power equals e.
So we have our gradient equals negative 1 over 2 plus e. Right.